Welcome back to Fabulum of Detailing. You guys, I've received a lot of emails ever since we opened up the website on January 1st. Instant messages, uh, tons of messages, you guys. Uh, people saying, hey, you know, I wanna know what I should try on your website. You have products from companies that I've never heard of before, like Distinctive Details. Just trying to figure out what I should look at, maybe possibly buying, what you recommend. So I decided I wanna put a video together showing you 10 items, not in any order. They're not one through 10 or anything like that. Uh, 10 items that I sell on the website uh, that I definitely recommend for people that aren't sure, they're kind of on the fence of what they should buy. This will get you guys started, and these are 10 items that I absolutely love. So, let's do it. So before we get this video started, you guys, take a minute, go down, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, uh, and make sure you turn on all post notifications. That's what that bell is right next to the subscribe button, because here in the future, I'm gonna be making videos on everything that I sell on the website so I can show you guys how well they work, how you should use them, and what to expect. So make sure you, you are subscribed to the channel so you do not miss those videos, especially if you decide to run sales. That way you're one of the first ones to know. So you guys, like I said at the beginning of the video, this is not a top 10 or anything like that. These are not in any particular order. These are just items that I sell on the website to give you guys an idea because I've had so many people ask me what they should try. These are 10 items that'll get you guys started and items that I can definitely recommend because it's items that I always use and I absolutely love them. So the very first item you guys is gonna be this vinyl and leather brush. You guys have probably seen these before. This one is made in China as you guys can see right here. Unfortunately, a lot of stuff, that's where it comes from. There's nothing you can really do about it. Um, but this, this product right here is fantastic. It's one that I've been using for a very, very long time. Uh, it's great for leather. It's great for your vinyl, your dashes, uh, steering wheel. It just really helps you agitate and get your cleaner really foamy and be able to lift the dirt up to the top of that foam so you can wipe it right up with your microfiber towel. It's great that it comes to a point because this allows you to get in those nooks and crannies, especially on leather seats down at the base where the, the back of the seat meets the bottom of the seat. It allows you to get in there and clean it really well. You don't have to have a ton of pressure. It's gonna clean the seats amazingly with the right cleaner obviously um, and you're going to get these results that you're going to be blown away with you wish you'd have had something like this years before instead of using a brush uh, to just manually agitate like this this just gets the job done a lot faster it's a nice shape it's easy to hold even with bigger hands it's easy to hold uh, this is definitely a leather brush that once you get it you'll be like i wish i'd have had that a long time ago all right you guys so the next thing uh, that i say definitely you want to give a shot is going to be Extreme Suds by Extreme Solutions. It just has my, my company's logo on it. It's all about branding, you guys. Um, but this is not my product. As you can see, Extreme Solutions. And I even left the name of the product the same. Um, but Extreme Suds is a fantastic pH neutral soap. Uh, it's not going to strip into your wax of sealants or your ceramic coatings or anything like that. It foams amazing in the foam cannon. All you need is two ounces and about a four gallon bucket. So about half an ounce per gallon to get crazy, crazy suds. And I usually put about an ounce to ounce and a half in my foam cannon, and I get nice, thick foam all over the car. When you're wiping on the car with your wash mitt, with this soap, you guys, there is a ton of lubricity to it. It just glides across the paint. It's not gonna leave any waxes or anything behind you guys. This is strictly just a shampoo that works absolutely amazing. I do sell in quarts and I also sell it in gallons. So the next thing I definitely recommend giving a shot, you guys, and I sell these in single packs and I also sell them in a four pack kit that comes with a cleaner and some gloves. It is the lithium trim cubes. These are brand new on the market. These are graphene infused like sponges, uh, but they're square, so they call it a cube. Um, this is a trim restorer that they guarantee will work for up to 250 washes, which is mind blowing. But you wanna know what's really mind blowing. There is a channel on YouTube, I think it's called Dimitri's Garage, that he tested this out and he washed the trim piece 1400 times before it failed. Crazy. Uh, so when they say it's gonna last 250 washes, they really mean it. This product is extremely easy to use, you guys. All you do is you just need to prep the surface with like an isopropyl alcohol, and make sure you get it good and dry just to make sure you strip off any maybe waxes that may be on there, grease or anything that could be on the trim that keep the product from bonding to the surface. Make sure that's good and cleaned off and then just take the cube out of the package and you just start wiping and it's really that easy. Uh, just go back and forth, uh, pay attention where you're going. If you get it on the paint, it's not a big deal. Just immediately wipe it off with a towel, but get the trim one section done. And then once that sec section is done, Take a towel and go over it to help level it, but it pretty much self-levels itself. When you get all done with it, you guys, 
the trim looks brand new. It's a dark, deep black and just looks absolutely amazing. And I do sell them in single packs if you don't want to buy a kit, which is awesome in case you just want to try it and see what happens. In fact, when we do mystery boxes again, I threw a ton of these in my mystery box for people to try out, you guys. So uh, pay attention for mystery boxes coming in the near future. But this is another thing that I definitely recommend trying for your trim restoration. So the next item, you guys, is Phoenix EOD's Titan. If you have not tried this hybrid quick detailer, you are missing out. This stuff is absolutely amazing. It is super slick when you put it on. The hydrophobics are amazing. The gloss is amazing. It's, it's so simple. I've had no issues with high spots, and I've actually overused it just to see if I can get high spots out of it. No issues at all with high spots. I use this on the Acura to finalize the detail, to just bring the extra gloss out, and the customer absolutely loved it, you guys. But Phoenix EOD is a rather new company, um, and he has several products, you guys, and I do sell pretty much every product that he has. I am sold out of a few of them at the moment, um, but I will make sure I have these when this video comes out if you guys are interested in it. So Phoenix EOD Titan, you guys, is going to last a couple months, probably about three months or so. A quick detail spray, and you use it like a detail spray, not like a wax. You just spray it on, wipe it off, and then buff it, and you are good to go. You'll be blown away by what the paint looks like when you get done using Phoenix EOD's Titan. So next thing, you guys, is going to be Extra Tough's Multi-Purpose Cleaner and Degreaser. This is an extremely underrated product because it cleans anything. It is amazing. The more and more I use it, the more and more I fall in love with it. The cleaning ratios are really good. You can go all the way up to 32 to 1 for general cleaning, 1 to 1 for wax and sealant removal because it's very, very strong. It's alkaline base. But the cool thing about it is it won't etch. You can use it on your paint to get rid of bugs and tar and stuff like that. If it dries on the paint, just reactivate it with water and you're good to go. But to show you guys how great this is, my daughter spilled nail polish on our carpet and we didn't know about it for a couple days. And I sprayed this on, agitated it a little bit with a brush, and it removed the nail polish without any issue at all, you guys. So, so this is one of those products, you guys, that is a must try. It's something that once you use it, you realize, oh man, this is awesome. And you find more and more and more and more and more uses out of it. I use it around the house. I use it around the cars, whether it's on the seats, uh, tires, the paint for bugs. It doesn't matter. Engine bays. I do sell it in this 32 ounce quart or I sell it by the gallon. Um, like I said, highly dilutable. The bottle is going to last you a long time if you dilute it correctly for the cleaning you want to use it for. Um, but Extra Tough is a fantastic product. All right, you guys. So the next one is, and it needs no introduction, uh, Diamond Clear Glass Cleaner. I made a video about this last weekend, actually, is a video that came out last weekend. I mean, it is the best glass cleaner I've ever tried. And I have tried a lot, a lot of glass cleaners in the past. And yes, I have people say, well, you didn't, you didn't have stoners and visible glass on the table. So your, your review isn't worth anything. Well, I've tried invisible glass in the past. I just didn't have any here, um, but I've tried that. I've tried pretty much all of them. This one beats every single one of them. It is solvent based, you guys. It cleans awesome. It flashes really fast and it's a two in one. So you can use this as an adhesive remover. Also, um, great product. It doesn't foam. That's the thing when people see aerosol, a lot of people say, oh, I don't like foaming products. This product does not foam. You spray it on, you have total control over the spray. You wipe it, flip it over buff it and the glass looks glossy if that makes sense it's it's really weird but it's extremely clean it's streak free diamond clear is exactly like a diamond in a rough all right you guys so another must have that i saw on the website this is my bottle that's why you're seeing it here um, i just wanted to show you guys one with a trigger sprayer on it is geon tar by the way if you get one from me and it comes and it's clear and all the pinks at the bottom that's totally normal it'll separate after about a day i just shook this up right before i made the video this stuff is so good. You just spray it on the tar, let it sit on there for about three or four minutes, right around. Don't let it dry. If it starts to dry, spray a little bit more on there or wipe it. You'll see the tar start to bleed black. And once it does that, you just take a towel and you just wipe it up. And I'm just now realizing, I don't think I've ever made a video on tar. So I probably don't have any video to show you guys, but it works so good as that. And then the other thing it works really good on, and I didn't know about this until I actually talked to Pan. I was doing a new car prep that had come to the house and it had the, uh, adhesive all the way around it from where they tore like the plastic off. And I was like, what's the best thing that you normally use on stuff like this? He said, take Gion Tar, spray it on your towel, like a little corner of your towel, spray it on your towel and just wipe it and it'll disappear. And man, it made that adhesive, it was gone. I mean, it was so simple to do. They just flip towel over, buff it and you're good to go. Now they do recommend when you get done using this to wash the car. I have done it without doing it. I've had no issues at all, you guys, but just take that into consideration. If you buy something like this, it does say the directions to wash the car when you get done. But Gion Tar 
is awesome, awesome on tar and adhesives. So next product, you guys, is Cheater Wax from Distinctive Details. This is a sheeting aid, drying agent, basically. Um, the cool thing about this bottle here, you guys, is it may say wax. Don't let that fool you. There's no waxes. There's no silicones in it. Um, this is strictly a drying agent. And this 32 ounce bottle will make 16 ounce bottles when you dilute it properly because it's, it's 15 to one. So that's gonna be two ounces of this product and 30 ounces of water. You can make 16 bottles. This is 10.99 on the website. That makes it like 68 or 69 cents per 32 ounce bottle. That's extremely cheap. Uh, so this one bottle of your DIY is gonna last you a really, really long time. If you are somebody that uh, details professionally, this bottle is still gonna last you a while, but I do sell it by the gallon also to even give you a better value. Now, obviously you can use more than two ounces. You can use four ounces, six ounces, whatever. I've had dealerships use this straight because uh, I sell it by five gallons. But the recommended dilution ratio is two ounces and 30 ounces of water, and it works extremely well like that. Now, what you're gonna wanna do when the car is still wet and you're getting ready to dry, you're just gonna spray it on the paint and you're gonna take a pressure washer and pressure wash it off. If you don't use pressure wash and you just have a garden hose, that's fine. Just make sure you uh, get it good and rinsed. And if you use a garden hose, you may notice that it does bead a little bit, but if you flood it with the water with the garden hose, it'll sheet right off and you barely even need a drying towel in your paint at that point, you guys. This is one of those products that's just absolutely amazing and a big bang for your buck right here. All right, we're down to two items left, you guys. So the next item is going to be Gion's Quick View. This product here is awesome on your glass because it's called Quick View, it's for your glass. It's extremely easy to use because all you do is you're gonna twist this, this cap off up here there's a felt applicator underneath it. You don't touch it at all. You're just touching the bottle. And all you're going to do is squeeze the bottle a little bit to wet in it. And then that's it. You're going to go and you're going to do circles around your window. Let it sit on there for five to 10 minutes. You're going to take a wet microfiber towel and wipe it off. And at first, when you go to wipe it off, it's weird. It doesn't look like it's wiping anything off. Then all of a sudden it flashes. It's gone. Um, this is going to last you up to six months. It's, it's past five months on my car and it's still there. It's still holding on. Um, but also when you use a product like this, any type of glass seal and glass coating, the life expectancy is also dependent on how often you use your washer because washer fluid has alcohol in it to help clean the bugs and guts off the window, which is going to degrade um, any coating or sealant that you have on your glass. But I use this on all the windows all the way around my cars. This bottle right here, I, I don't know how many cars it says it should do. I don't think Gion actually says, but if you do just your windshield, I bet you can do your windshield 50 times with this bottle. It's crazy. I have used it on all of my cars and my bottle still feels full. I'll tell you that much right now. So quick use, extremely easy to use, you guys. You're basically gonna wipe it on, let it let it cure, wipe it off with a damp towel and bam, you're ready to go. And you're gonna have hydrophobic glass that's gonna help you in snow, rain, sleet. A lot of times we don't even need your wipers because if you're doing above 50 miles an hour, that water is just coming right up off that glass because that it makes it so slick that you don't even need your wiper blades. It's gonna make your driving safer. So you guys, the last thing on the list is going to be distinctive details, ceramic 5,000 paint sealant. Please do not get the sealant uh, confused with not being a coating. You, you gotta remember a sealant is anything that you're going to seal, you're gonna seal the paint in is what you're doing. Um, but it is a 9H hardness coating, cause here it is right here. It's a 9H hardness coating, you guys. It's very hydrophobic, which is awesome. We'd love to see that on ceramic coatings and it, it, it's absolutely amazing. Um, it is anti-dust, anti-static. And people always ask, well, how do I keep the dust off my car? You know, there's nothing that's going to be completely dust proof, but being anti-static, that's going to help out in that area, you guys. And it is UV resistant, so you know it's going to protect your paint, but it's extremely easy to use. So all you're going to do, you're going to have the bottle in here with the applicator and a towel. And then basically all you need from that point is a car. And you're going to just apply it to your applicator and you're going to apply it in crosshatch patterns. And then you can, you wait 15 to 20 minutes before removal. So you can do the whole car if you do it fast enough and then come back and just remove the whole car. But what I did is I applied it to the hood, the fender, the door, the rear door and the rear quarter panel. And I took my time. And by the time I got done doing that, it had been a roughly 15 minutes and I came back up and I was like, holy cow, you couldn't see where the coating was. It's like it was self leveling. Um, there's a few spots here and there where it was like extra thick that I could see it. So it's important to go back over it. You're gonna remove it with like a polish towel. You're not removing, you're removing this transfer solution is what you're doing uh, and leveling the coating out. Um, and then you wait an hour and then you do apply a second coat. Now don't let that turn you off because the second coat is a breeze um, because the coating is so slick that when you put that second coating on that the applicator just glides across the paint. And when you go to remove it, you feel how slick that paint is with a towel. And then you guys, you are good to go. You can wait uh, 24 hours, 12 hours and then top it with something, or you can just leave it the way it is. 
um, and you are basically good to go from there. It's so easy. Like I said in my video, my eight-year-old daughter could do it. It's that simple to do. And they give you pretty much everything you need right in this kit to do the job. And you may need a, a, a couple extra towels for, for uh, leveling and removal. Um, but other than that, everything you need is going to be inside this kit right here, you guys. The Ceramic 5000 paint sealant by Distinctive Details is a must-have, and it's extremely easy to use. All right, you guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. So this is 10 items on my website um, that I definitely can recommend if you're on the fence. You just don't know um, what to purchase. I know 100% you will love each and every one of these products. If you just pick up one of them, test it out, you'll absolutely love it. Um, and that way you kind of get an idea of some of the stuff that I am selling on the website because I do have brands like Distinctive a lot of people haven't heard of, um, High Tech a lot of people haven't heard of, um, but I also have other brands like Gion, Extreme Solutions, Vonix, Vonix a lot of people haven't heard of either. Uh, Vonix, I have auto fiber towels, like the coating saver applicators and stuff like that. I've got tons of applicators as far as wax applicators. I have tools, quite a bit of stuff on the website and the website's gonna continue to grow. Just please be patient with me. Um, it has been a learning curve to say the least of how to run the, run the website, how to add products to it, descriptions to it, pricing to it, weigh, weigh each and every item so that my uh, shipping is correct, you guys. But we are getting there and I expect this, this website to grow even more. I am not going to be satisfied with everything that I have right here. I want to be your one-stop shop eventually in the future where you can come to the website. You can find what you want from this brand or this brand or this brand all in one place. Put it in a cart, check out. You're going to have it in a couple of days and you'll be good to go. So that's my goal there, you guys. We'll just see. We'll see how well that takes off, you guys. And oh, by the way, you guys, I do have the Fab Tumblers in stock now, red and black. Uh, you can find those down in the Fab merch. My new shirts like this one right here that I have on are on order. I don't know how soon we're going to get them because of COVID. Everything takes longer, you guys, because um, we did sell out those really fast once the website opened. But they are on order, so just pay attention to the website down the Fab merch. They will be back in there eventually, you guys. So I want to say thank you guys so much for checking this video out. Hopefully this video was helpful for you guys if you just weren't sure what you wanted to buy. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss my future videos. Join the Fab family. We'd love to have you. We'll see you in the next video. Oh,